Hey, what's up, what's up, YouTube? It's Razor. So, welcome back to Let's Play Rogue Galaxy. In the previous episode, we got some blueprints in Gerard, and um, explored more of the Dom here. So, in this episode, we're gonna explore even more. So, so far, we've, we've explored this much. So, we got a lot more to explore. Well, I highly doubt we'll be able to advance the plot in this episode. Oh, a stellar crystal. Alright, I can see Jasper fire resistance. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Fire resist fire resistance level two. Oh yeah, I'll go ahead and show you the blueprints we got in the last episode. Alright. Yeah, that's right. In the last episode, we got a prom you will be. That'll give Jaster HP up level 1. Very nice. It's always good to have more HP. Sorry, that's my dog. Alright. I saw my dog got a uh, growl in every video. Oh, there's new enemy Death Crows. We got a lot of HP, as you can tell, or a decent amount of HP. Sorry about that. Alright, maxed out that weapon. I got a Captain Sock for beating that battle. Go ahead and get that to Jasper here to teach him Whirlwind Level 2. There we go. Yeah, I don't really use Whirlwind all that much, but I might try to use it in this next battle. There's better moves for Jasper to use. Let's go ahead and use it here. Whirlwind level 2. Basically, charge your enemies and knock them back. Boom! Like a football player. Yeah, it boosts his movement speed too. Sorry about that, my dog. Fighting her tail. Hey, now she's messing up my report by stepping on the AV cords. Alright, Jasper leveled up. Very nice. Guys are no challenge at all. Yeah, I do need to start analyzing these weapons. 
So when I get to the save point, I'll cut the video. And I'll do all the analyzing off screen. Hard candy times two. Yeah, this is basically another observation deck here. When in doubt, viewers just use Desert Wing. You better collect some information first. Another chart chest over here, if I can get it, that'd be great. Mercy Sprites, a new weapon for Casal there. More army family, huh? Sounds dangerous. Alright, now this thinking circle here. Let's go ahead and examine it. Somewhere a beast is on a bloodthirsty crowd to dazzle, to distract the hold to the sky, a mirror that scatters all light all over. So that'd be a mirror unit. Right there, I have it, but I don't want to use it now. Cause I'll, remember the hunts we got a couple episodes ago? That's what that is. That's one of the hunts we got. I'm going to cut the video here, and I'm going to examine the uh, weapons and all that, and I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. I analyzed some weapons and all that. Here's what we got for Jasper so far. And Kasala. Alright, that's it for now. Let's go ahead and fight that uh, monster now. Our first hunt. Let's see, we want to use a mirror unit. You gotta use a particular item. Flabbergazer. The tomb the tome guardian flabbergazer. So let's use flash sword level two. Oh yeah, I gotta show you what we got equipped and all that. I equipped the best weapons that I had. I got this off screen. The Justice Strike. And then the Mercy Sprites and the Lovely Taps. Yeah, I got the Justice Sprites by combining the Apollo on uh, Shooter with uh, Body on ZX. I didn't mean to do it though, I did it by accident. Alright. Let's go ahead and fight him. If my controller would stop messing up. Then use dagger slash with the saw. Remember he's a giant so you gotta attack his head. Yeah, you can defend against that shockwave when he jumps up in the air. Make sure you stay healed, he does a lot of damage, so. Especially since you only have two characters, so. Yeah, just have, uh, uh, Saul do the healing. You do not use the gun against this guy, so. So I use Blast Sword again. You can also jump and avoid the shockwave if you want to. But it'd probably be easier just to guard against it. There you go, took it now. Make sure you're, uh,
Make sure to stay at, we get a thousand uh, Zen and Guardian 44, but make sure to keep everybody alive at the end of the battle. That way you get a full amount of EXP for it. As you can tell, we got 3,500 EXP for that. So yeah, make sure Jaster and Kasal survive. So if you have to revive before you kill it. If one of your characters die, that is. <laughs> And that Guardian 44 is, you, you'll learn about that later on, don't worry about it. I'm not going to spoil anything. Alright, so let's teleport back to here and then we'll take the other path. But that was Flabbergazer. Also when you're done fighting the quarry, we gotta exchange points. And as you can tell, we get 8,500 for Flabbergazer. So that brings our 100 points up to 82,250. And we went from 41 to 37. So we'll be able to get the rank 40 uh, reward. Alright, so we get a deep squid, that's prestige. And a hunter coin. We better collect some information first. Alright, so let's head south now. Yeah, the Justice Strike's like a beam weapon for Jasper, a beam gun. Oh yeah, I gotta change his uh, sword. Even though that diamond free is really powerful. Yeah, I got this weapon off screen, the diamond the Murakuma type EX. The more arms you can, huh? Sounds dangerous. Yeah, one good thing about training, you don't have to worry about getting into random encounters. Yeah, there's actually a dual blueprint right here under this uh, bridge. Concealing medicine. That'll be good for preventing random encounters, but I don't recommend it. Unless you don't like to fight enemies. But I can just use Desert Wind and kill enemies in five seconds, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, so we got a shop here. Oh, uh, check type for now, though. We can't go in there yet. Or at least we activated the transporter. We better collect some information first. Four stray dogs just doesn't win them. Yeah, it doesn't win as overpowered. Or level, doesn't win level 2, I mean. Alright, so let's head west. Hope it all goes well. Just trying to fill out the map. Or zombies, you already see them, so I'll just get them in. There's no crest in that turret chest, and there's a couple turret chests over here as well. Uh, we need the sun key for that one. Electric eel.
All right, another blueprint here. Crystal power. Oh, we can't go down there yet. Remember that for later, though. We'll be headed there later. You'll learn more about that later, so don't worry about it. Alright, so let's head back. And head south here. When in doubt, desert wind it. Getting prime will be. Yeah, the stray dogs drop prime will be. But you can feed the insectors. But I recommend just keeping them for a revelation. You might be able to use them in the factory later, I don't know. Alright, treasure chest over here. Carbon alloy. Alright, let's head this way. Ooh, a cursed mask. Pretty rare item there. Go ahead and put that to use. I'll give it to Lilica. Better collect some information. Chair chest up here. Stealth pills. Which I'll be putting use later on in the game. Pretty rough and tumble power. It's good when you've completed the battle recorder. That's what I recommend using uh the stealth kills. Once you complete the battle recorder, there's no really no point in fighting anymore. Yeah, it's a big place. Uh, no, I'm just gonna run from these guys. I'll fight him later on off screen. Alright, another save point here, so I'm in the video here. In the next episode, we'll explore more of Adon. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode and be sure to check out my other guides and videos on my channel. Please subscribe. Later.